Hey guys, good morning. I really wanted bagels, orange juice, strawberries, and some bacon. So I ran to Wegmans this morning, got some fresh bagels. They were still warm. I want to try cooking my bacon in my little air fryer. I think it would be less messy than on the stovetop and in the oven it just seems to sometimes get uh, overcooked. So we're going to try this it's thick cut. I don't like crispy bacon. So I think I'm going to try it at about 7 or 8 minutes at 400 degrees and see how it turns out. I think I'll only put um, 4 or 5 slices because I just have a smaller air fryer um, and it's just enough bacon for me this morning. So let's give it a shot and see if it works. Okay, so in my small air fryer I squeezed 4 pieces in there. So it's enough for a, a single serving. We'll see how this goes. Obviously, it'd be better if I had a bigger air fryer, but uh, it is what it is. So we'll just try and do all this with one hand. I'm gonna have to put you guys down. All right, so we got 400, and I'm gonna go for eight minutes because those were some thick slice pieces of bacon. All right, I'm gonna get the toaster out now and get a bagel started. Okay guys, so this is after eight minutes. I think it can go for a couple more. So I'm gonna go ahead and put it in for like two more minutes and we'll check it at that point and see. Okay, I put it on for two minutes. I hope I don't regret that decision. We'll see, it was thick slice. So if this comes out good, then that will be a total of 12 minutes. So cross your fingers. Okay, so that was with the additional two minutes. I think we're, it, we're done. Uh, so that was a total of 12 minutes and it's not crispy. If you want crispy bacon and you are using the thick slice, then you'd have to just kind of uh, cook it longer, obviously. I think for me this is good. And again, I don't like my bacon. I think that should be fine. I don't like my bacon. That piece there, man. I don't know. It almost That piece there almost looks like it needs to go for another minute. Oh, guys. But, you know, if you overcook bacon, then it's just like you're just chewing on bacon bits. I think I'm going to let that go. Because I think as it sits there, it'll kind of continue to to cook a little and the texture will change. I think I'm happy with that, guys. I don't know. Comment down below. Do you like your bacon crispy or chewy? Um, do you think I cooked that piece long enough? I think it'll be fine. So that was a total of 12 minutes on 400 degrees in the air fryer for thick cut bacon. Thanks guys.